Hello there, Internet. My name is the Valks, and I am playing Kirby's Dreamland 3. Uh, it's been a long time since I've updated anything, because my computer that I've had up until this point has been a piece of crap. And since it's my birthday soon, I got a new computer, and it's a lot more powerful. So if you remember, we are doing a no power run, so that means we have to fight all the bosses, do all the levels, etc, etc, without any powers. At least until we get to the point where we have to use power to get anything, get anywhere. Come on. So this battle is pretty simple. If you uh, this battle's pretty simple, as long as you don't get hit by anything, just keep squirting at Acro, anything that he shoots out of his mouth, these rocks, just whatever he shoots at you. You can't shoot back the anchor anchors that he was shooting out earlier, though, so that was pretty simple. And off we go. To level 3. I've already... I did some practice recording, but it didn't turn out very well, so looks like I have to do this over again. So, this level is a pretty simple way to get... The way to get this star is pretty simple. Just hit all the pink flowers, but none of the brown flowers. Brown, brown mushrooms. So just keep going and going, being sure to avoid anything, getting a power if you want one, but I don't, and make sure you don't die. And so, uh, get down there, blah da day get down there Kirby, very good. And that should be the last one, the sound played, so we are good to go. The rest of the level's just pretty simple for Kirby. Oh, watch the bunny. See that? That is where you want to go. Because there's one-ups and stars galore. Huzzah? I do think so. Now let's keep on moving. There's animals in here. Do we want a partner? I think we'll go with Pitch for now. Why not? Uh, la -da. So, how has everyone been? I know all 30 of you have probably not really cared, but it doesn't matter. How no, does it? So, keep going. Not really much to commentate on, except the music is for a Kirby game. I love Kirby's music. Ah, can't slide with a pet, so that's not any fun. Whoa, that was a close one. Huzzah. Oh, this part gave us trouble. Ugh, last time I recorded. Okay, have to be careful and make sure not to run into... Oh, come on! Oh wait, I saved state, didn't I? Yes, I did, because I am prepared with my new controller, so nothing upsetting will happen in our journey, because I don't want to have to rewind too far back every single time uh, something bad happens. That's not only for my convenience, that is also for your convenience. So let's continue. Last time I recorded this, the cursor was right in the center of the screen. And I am not letting that happen. And, oh, come on, I'm actually doing better without my friend here than I was doing with him here. I don't know how that's going, how that's working, but 
just did it. Oh god. I got a new headset to a turtle beach, which they're pretty nice. So, silly cavemen. Cavemen will shoot anything you hit at them back at you. That even includes your air that you spit out whenever you're flying. See? And let's be sure not to get hit by the rain or the hang gliders. Or stupid cavemen. Hang gliders. Okay, last time we did this, I made it to the very end of the stage and got hit by a hang glider. And since I hadn't save stated in a while, that messed everything up. Okay, that was perfect. See, and I got a one-up that time, but if you had followed what I had done, uh, considering the red flowers, uh, you would have gotten the heart star piece there. But, anyway, uh, la la, let's see if we have enough time. If we don't, I will split this video and the next video into two parts. Ah, sand slows you down. There are spiky monsters here that are on top of the cacti. Cacti. And the shovel thingies aren't very helpful either, even though they haven't done anything to me. What they'll do is they'll shovel into the ground. Let's see if we can get one to do it. Yeah, that. That's what they'll do. So avoid that. Some sand actually helps you, but most of the time it just slows you down. Because sand can move in Kirby games, thanks to Nintendo Logic. But, I digress. Okay. And there's the next area. Mr. Umbrella. Oh, bother. Okay, it doesn't matter. We'll just go back to right here. Easy enough. And keep moving. Spiders. Oh, spiders. Go up here, and you will find a secret door if you hold up. And you will find sodas, medicine, whatever it is, and a one-up. Ah, oh, god. Freaking... What are those spiders called, anyway? I would like to know. Okay... And that was simple enough. Now, you'll want to get this broom here, if you're anyone except me, because no powers after all. But to get that broom, and keep it, until you are in... Blah, 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 blah. Don't go through the doors! Bad thing about using an analog stick to play a 2D game. It will mess with your up and down. Okay, what you want to do is use the broomstick here to clear off all of that black uh, dust or whatever it is. And do the same thing in this room as well. And that is all that you need to do to get the heart star piece. So just continue on and don't get hit or killed, etc. And you should come across another room, which is completely covered in sand. Thank you. And the sand will mo work against you rather than for you, pushing you down the hill, which is no fun. And these black dots are here just for I don't know. Why are they here? Regardless. Are we... Are we at the end yet? Come on. Yeah. We, we, we should get there soon. And jump. Jump. And there's that thing. Dang it. Underneath here is a maximum tomato. But I don't have time to stop if I want to get this all done in a single video. Oh, so... Okay. Those things just disappear. Those things actually do. Waddle Dee Ghost. La la la. The genies in the lamp. They don't grant my wishes. Ah, and there we go. That was 
That was simple. How did I die? I didn't do anything for you. Thank you. And that should put us back here for the next video. So, next time on Let's Play Kirby's Dream Land 3, we will tackle this stage, which we do get a Heart Star piece in, and this one, which I didn't actually finish yet. So, I will see you next time.